Hello everyone, Sungoku Rocks here today, and today this will be my first Let's Play video, so let's go ahead and turn the volume down because that interferes a little bit. And um, today I'm going to be playing Pokemon Ash Gray. Now, um, you know, this is basically a ROM hack Pokemon game. It is a ROM hack version of Pokemon Fire Red and Leaf Green, and it is basically a fan made version that is closer to the anime. So, without further ado, we're going to go ahead and start this Let's Play, but first, let's watch the trailer, or the intro. Alright, sorry about that, guys, but now we're going to continue back to our Let's Play. So let's just go ahead and, um, mess with the joypad right here. Um... Actually, everything seems alright for now, so let's go ahead and press start. Um, what start on this? Why isn't this doing anything? Oh, there we go. Yeah, no idea what that is. So the various buttons will be explained in the order of their importance. We already know all this. You are a boy from Pallet Town. Now that you are 10, you can get your own Pokemon license. 10 years old can get a beginner Pokemon from Professor Oak, the town's Pokemon expert. This is just the beginning of your amazing adventures. Your journey is destined to be packed with non-stop action, millions of laughs, heart-pounding perils, and endless excitement. You'll encounter fantastic friends, evil enemies, and meet creatures beyond your wildest imagination. And as you, as your story unfolds, you'll unlock the magic and mystery of the world of Pokemon. I know I have such an epic voice. And there's Professor Oak. Hello there, glad to meet you. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Oak. People affectionately refer me to the Pokemon Professor. This world is inhabited far and wide by creatures called Pokemon. For some people, Pokemon are pets, others use them for battling. As for me myself, I study Pokemon as a profession. I hear you want to catch and train your own Pokemon. Let's begin with your name. What is it? So, since we're just gonna try to play this out like the anime, let's just go with Ash for now. Cause you know, this is just a let's play, you know, whatever. So like I said, this is basically a hacked version of Fire Red and Leaf Green that is more closer to the actual anime itself. That's why, you know, hence the name Pokemon Ash Gray. So, let's go. So, you know, I'm not really gonna read all of it, because this is kind of the obvious. So, in the anime, you know, Professor Oak's son is named Gary. So, let's start our own Pokemon adventure. Let's go. And this is our room. Pretty small room, if you ask me. I mean, I don't really know what you do in here. But, you know, all the houses in Pokemon are pretty small. So, you know, I just don't know how, like... Ne you know what, never mind, it's hard to explain, but whatever. So, it's your pajamas. Would you like to change into them? Uh, let's say no for now. Let's just kind of play it out and see what happens. It's a live Pokemon match on TV. Gengar vs. Nidorino. Whoops, better we get going. So if we try to go downstairs, you know, it's just like the anime. Um, Ash's mom yells at him, Ash, get to bed, it's 11 o'clock, you should be asleep. Go to bed and don't forget to change your pajamas. Okay, so that's that, angry mom. Um, let's change in our pajamas, just like the anime. And we're supposed to because, you know, we're basically getting ready for bed. To start a Pokemon journey the next day. Ash went to sleep and dreamed of getting his first Pokemon. Raising Bulbasaur. That'd be really simple. It's perfect for beginners. And then there's Squirtle. Choose it or lose it. Oh, hold on. Charmander. Those in the note say that's the best way to go. Okay. Kind of weird sounding, but whatever. Ash woke up from his rest of sleep. And this is basically the part where Ash realizes he's very late. I think his mom tells you that. Yep. Oh, Ash, you woke up late, didn't you? You better hurry. Professor Oak next door will be expecting you. I think if we hold down a certain button, we could also speed up the speed of the actual ROM. What button is it? 
Okay, I don't know at the top of my head what button you push to speed up. Oops. The emulator? But I'll figure it out later. So here's Pallet Town. As you can see, it's um, way more closer to the anime. It looks a lot more like the Pallet Town in the anime than the actual traditional games. If you go down, Professor Oak's lab is pretty big too. Which is pretty cool. I mean, this is a very well done Pokemon ROM hack that um, someone made. It probably said it at the beginning of the intro, but I forgot the name. It's like Metapod something, but I don't know. So if we go here... Hey! Where are you? Where are you going? Oh, you must be Ash. Better late than ever, I guess. Well, Ash, you snoozy lose, and you're right behind from the start. I've got a Pokemon and you don't, and I've got the best one. It pays to have a grandfather in Pokemon business. Now I, Gary Oak, am off to learn the ways of Pokemon Trainer. See you later, Ashy boy. What a terrible nickname. I've always hated Gary Oak in the anime. He always had that group of, like, freaking cheerleaders when he was, like, what, 10 years old? Cheering him on? And I don't even know how old they were, but, you know, whatever. Or maybe, is Gary older than Ash? I don't know, he seems older, but whatever. Well, I guess if we go back here, we have the back of uh, Professor Oak's lab. We have all these Pokemon, and there's Psyduck. Psy Psy. I'm not gonna talk to all of these, but you know, I just wanna... ...pour a quick glance around. Pikachu. That is not... However, that's not the Pikachu we'll be getting. Because, you know, if, you, if you've already seen the show, you already know how this goes out. Ash, is, you know, he gets a Pikachu. That's his first starter. And there's Professor Oak. So, Ash, you've decided to show up after all. You want a Pokemon, eh? From the looks of it, you aren't ready for a Pokemon training. Okay, that's kind of messed up. Hmm, so you say you're ready? Alright then, as you wish. Well, Ash, if you're ready for a Pokemon. Oh. So, I wish I had an overslept, but not. I'll choose my Pokemon, Bulbasaur. So, let's go Bulbasaur. Sure. Oh, crap, it's taken. I thought about it a lot, and it took me a long time, but I finally decided to choose Squirtle. Uh, yeah, sure. I like Squirtle. And it looks like Squirtle's gone. Um, well, that's no problem because my Pokemon will be Charmander. And Charmander's gone. So now we can pretty much predict what's going to happen next. Yes, all the star Pokemon have been giving away, but two trainers here are on time. Well, there is one left, but I think I should warn you that there is a problem with this. Last one. Its name is Pikachu. Will you try to train this electric mouse type? Yes, because we want to continue with the rest of this game. And we're totally not just saying that just to say that. Because we actually want to, uh, whatever, that didn't make any sense what I just said. Yeah, blah, blah, blah. Your Pokedex and Pokeballs. <laughs> Pokeballs. <laughs> uh, we know that. I played this game, I played Pokemon before, I know, yeah, yes, yes, yes. Yes, I know, I know. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and start training Pikachu, but first let's look more around this beautiful lab. Because it might not look the best, but it is way better compared to Fire Red and Leaf Green at least. So, you know, I am, it's not that big, but definitely bigger than the other games. Wait, was that a picture of an old man up there? I just have to see that. He looks like some... He looks like that one guy from the Muppets. Oh! Uh, give me a second. Pause the recording. Alright, we are back to recording. So... I think that's pretty much it for this lab. If you look right here, it's Mom! Hi, Mom! Ash, I'm so glad I caught you. I'm so proud of you. You're finally fulfilling your dreams. You're starting your journey as a trainer. But I'll miss you so much. I brought you some traveling items. There's your running shoes. Now, I never really understood why in this game we have to have running shoes to actually run. Maybe because we don't want to ruin our other shoes like in mud or grass or whatever. But still, it's like it's not like it's impossible to run without running shoes. 
This is really weird. But you know, it's a Pokemon game, so you know, what can I expect? And we all know, you know, Pikachu doesn't like to be in its Pokeball. It gets very feisty at the beginning of the series. And did she just float? Did did, did you guys just see that? Did she, did she literally just float all the way from, like, here to here? Whatever. Um, but, you know, that's that. <laughs> There's our house. So, you know, let's go ahead and get going. Route 1. We're walking on Route 1. There's a Pidgey. It's looking away. Go Pikachu. Why do those trees look like they have faces on them? They do look right there. That's really weird. You can make a song of pretty much anything in these Pokemon games. Yeah. Holy crap. I just figured out when I put my mouse. Right here, the quality instantly. Oh, okay, never mind. Now it doesn't look better. You can't leave without Pikachu. Oh no, Spiro! I always hated this thing. Hey, it looks like this is our first official Pokemon battle. So we're gonna send out Pikachu, even though it was already out of its Pokeball, but you know. And we're gonna use Thunder Shock because it's super effective against Fine. Okay, Pikachu will not obey. That isn't good. But. Spiro's paralyzed. So we press on start again. Pikachu still won't obey. Not really gonna do any good. We don't even have any physical attacks, but whatever. The Spiro is furious at Pikachu. It's calling for the other Spiro to help. Oh, well that's great. So now we're basically on foot. And we're gonna make a run for it. But, I'm actually going to end off the episode right here because I don't want to go over time and be waiting forever to upload. So, if there are audio problems and if you do have trouble hearing me, let me know because I don't have a good microphone. But, I just need to kick off the series already, so there you go. So, this is Spirit Bomb Gaming signing out. Signing out. So, yeah, see you guys later. Bye-bye.